Hello and welcome back to Mr. Caro Plays FM 23. Now today we're going to do something in match, not something that I do regularly. Uh, most of my tips more recently have been out of game, uh, but certainly uh, this is one that's in a match scenario. So what we're going to do, and it's, as I only played a couple of minutes, so this is not necessarily a live one for this particular game, but this is something that I'm going to talk about and try and uh, give an opinion on. So imagine a scenario where we are unable to break down our opponents. You know, you can see it. Uh, maybe they've had a yellow card on that side of the pitch, maybe right back or a left back has had a yellow, uh, and we want to, we know that we want to start pressing the ball down that side of the pitch. Now, in order to do that, it's quite simple in some ways. Uh, this may be obvious to some people, but not to others, perhaps. So in, if we had that scenario, imagine this tactic wasn't played out like this. We had just our play from the back. Now, obviously, if we wanted to do that, we know that we've got a, our, their right back has... Uh, a yellow card on on that side of the pitch so we want to effectively put all our kind of influence down on the left hand side so we're going to go kind of crazy on that left hand side the idea being uh, that we are putting extra pressure on that side of the pitch now obviously with that said what we're kind of encouraging is we are almost encouraging them to you know, we're, we're to make that foul, to give away that free kick, to get another yellow card. Because obviously, if you've had a yellow card, maybe you wouldn't dive into the tackle again. Now, if we look within our tactics and our other options here, uh, we can we can again we can distribute to our fullbacks. We can try and make that kind of pressure on that, and we maybe we even want to distribute to our flanks. You know, whatever you choose to do, the idea being you are trying to exploit those areas of the pitch where you know you can gain that small little bit of an advantage. Now, obviously, this is a change of tactic for, for at the start of the, you know, this is a new tactic that you would be implementing in-game. And now some people won't want to do that. Uh, you know, we all have tactics that we use, um, but this is kind of the idea that something isn't working. You know, you're, you're drawing nil-nil after 60 minutes. Uh, what can I do to change this? Now, you're looking for those small advantages within that okay and and like i say if you, you're exploiting that side of the pitch whether it be the left or the right even if you wanted to play straight through the middle maybe the midfielders are both on yellow cards you know or maybe even you want to play over the top you want to hit that early cross in you want to kind of real put pressure on those central defenders now obviously there's many ways to do this but the idea that i'm trying to put across without going into too much detail is you want to exploit those areas of the pitch which have the game has developed throughout the game so not something you had envisioned at the start of the game but something that has developed throughout the match uh, and you're trying to put emphasis on that area to try and exploit that to try to gain those advantages because maybe you thought you were going to win 4-0 and actually after 60 minutes it's 0-0 that kind of thing and maybe you want to play more narrow so you do like I say that is the kind of idea behind that you're just exploiting uh, the advantages that you have if you like this video please give it a like and subscribe hit the notification button for more videos thank you and goodbye